Good morning. It is Saturday the 2nd of July. Bit of a different mood around the house this morning. Everyone's a bit more quiet. I can kind of feel the tension in the air as they say. Reason is because we are doing a pro kermis in Belgium in a town called Zelle. I'm not even going to bother to try and explain anything about pro kermises right now because I don't know the first thing about pro kermises. All I do know is that today is 154 kilometers and it's 12 laps of a 12 kilometer circuit. Nothing more to say for now. The guys are going to pack the van. We're going to hit the road, drive across the border into Belgium and we'll see what it's like when we get there. So we just arrived in Belgium um, and it's a beautiful day as you will see out the window. John has just woken up from his little Good morning vlog. Morning vlog. <laughs> yeah, and we're tucked in and we're ready to go. Yeah, it's yeah. good good air here. Bit of vibes down Sen here. Sensations are here. unreal sensations are right. Welcome to Zelle, Belgium. This is the start of a pro Kermes. It's really cool, they got the betting boards. So all the old Belgian dudes are placing their bets, putting the odds on. And the guys are actually on the board. They got all of them on there, listed on there. About $30 to one chance of winning. Hi Lauren. Hello. Good luck. Thank you. <laughs> you too. No, no. Someone just put a, ben, a bed on Ben Cam. Oh, good. I think it was like 10 euros. Yeah. Let's go in now. Guaranteed. So boys are off. Cut to the GoPro footage. We'll let the GoPro footage run, but I just wanted to do a quick explanation of what a pro kermis is because it is a bit of a, a mystery. Well, it was to me. The reason why it can be confusing is because it's not a UCI categorized race. So you would assume that the fields are weaker at these races, but they're not. It's a weird non-UCI race where you'll still get world tour riders, pro conti riders, and all the strong continental teams showing up to race. If you're a continental level rider, especially one from Europe, and you win a Pro Kermis, it's really good exposure to you for scouts, for World Tour teams and development teams at the World Tour level. They're looking for the strongest riders in these races, which is why you'll see these continental level riders racing hell for leather to try and get a result. <laughs> Lap two, that's like a 10 man break with no Nero in it. One at the wheel, we've got a flat. Oh. So the neutral space didn't stop. No, because there's like. You turn. Right, and take this real narrow, only one car bit, kind of a take. 30 kilometers in, Jono got a flat and the neutral spares didn't stop for him, which is really annoying. And we've been wondering where Miles is, turns out he, he crashed, so he's, he's come off on a corner, which is good news, generally if you come off on a corner you, you're usually okay. So we haven't seen him, so hopefully he's alright, but yeah, two guys out so far. I was bridging across because I was on the front with Ben and he's like out of this corner just whack it and go for it. And then just around this corner I just like slid out. Like I don't even know what there's nothing on the road. Like not the tires just like gave way. I put my hand up, like pulled over, and then 
they just looked at me and drove past. Oh, it's Ben. She's not feeling good. B2. <laughs> um, ben Spencer said he wasn't feeling great this morning, and yeah, uh, not a good day for Ben. So he's pulled in. What's that? Ben's doing the work of three riders. Fun to say it, huh? Right. What happened? Oh, we just got pulled. They oh. called. They called the race because the brake had six minutes on us. Six minutes. And, and I don't think there's no one else in the race, so we can probably leave. 100k into the race and we've all been pulled. So we all get to go home early and rest up. Uh, this video was going to be titled This is a Belgian Pro Camise and I guess this is a fitting ending because these races are really freaking hard. And now we're all going home early. So that's it. We try again. The boys have a Dutch crit tomorrow night and we will uh, soldier on. Hope you enjoyed this video anyway. Got something out of it. We've got three more of these races, these pro camises, while we're over here. We also do want to get home, so I'm not going to stay around to film the finish. So unfortunately for this video, we're not going to see the ending to see who won. Uh, but maybe next time we will capture the whole thing.